Hi, I'm Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrock in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the Weather Now link. Finishing up a you know, pretty nice day. Clouds have moved back in, and we, um, we do have some showers on the way, but not until the overnight hours and spilling over into very early on a Tuesday morning. It's the last thing we need. Look at these numbers. Ouch. Number of days with measurable rain, 20 during the month of April. That's the most on record uh, for the month of April. So obviously pretty wet. It's not the wettest April on record as far as rainfall amounts, uh, but it does rank up there in the uh, in the top 10. And unfortunately getting some, some more showers uh, overnight early on uh, Tuesday morning. All right, Narragansett Town Beach as of, what time is it? 7.30 in the evening. It's it's mainly cloudy. You can see the, uh, the Newport Pell Bridge off in the distance. It's dry. We'll stay dry this evening. And that uh, shower activity coming in uh, after midnight. High temps today. Actually, Providence made it to 63 and not 60. I mean, the average high is about 64, 65, so close to average. But unfortunately, the next um, several days are going to be running cooler than average. Now, at last check, as of the 7 o'clock hour, North Kingstown, mostly cloudy, dry, 52. I do expect the temperatures to be heading down into the 40s during the overnight hours into early tomorrow morning. So dry weather for now, a dry evening, showers later tonight, and unfortunately cooler air ahead uh, for this week. Temperatures will be running a bit below average, and the week looks unsettled. It's not that we have any big storms on the way, but we do have several chances for precipitation. And here's the first chance. This is likely. This will be um, coming through during the uh, overnight hours. You see it in upstate New York and out towards um, uh, Pennsylvania. That's tracking off to the east. Let me widen out the view. You can see that little, it's actually an area of low pressure. That'll move east, bring some of that uh, light rain in here late at night. Up until, I would say, about, say, 8, 9 o'clock on uh, Tuesday morning. Thereafter, it'll dry out, but the clouds may linger a better part of the day. That'll keep the temperature down, but at least the afternoon is dry. All right, take it into the future. This is overnight and towards um, about 8 o'clock in the morning, so we're waking up to damp weather, some leftover light. You know, rain showers are drizzle, but notice the bulk of that activity is pushed offshore by noontime, so we do dry out. Uh, the clouds, though, they're, they're somewhat stubborn. They'll linger most of the day, but I think we'll get some partial breaks of sun during the mid to late afternoon hours. It's kind of a different look at it, starting off at 7 o'clock this evening, and we'll take you through the uh, overnight cloudy, cool. See late night, uh, overnight towards, uh, this is uh, 7 o'clock in the morning, uh, some showers, uh, temperature starting off at about uh, 45 degrees. So it does start off damp early in the morning. I'm thinking by certainly mid-morning and by noontime, a lot of this precipitation is pulling away. Uh, that 2 o'clock temperature of 48, that may be too cool. I'm thinking more like mid-50s Tuesday afternoon. The clouds will linger. We'll see some partial breaks in the overcast. And I think we'll see enough of that so that we should get temperatures up into the mid-50s. Uh, uh, Tuesday evening, 6 o'clock, clouds are breaking up a little bit more. Uh, cool and dry. Kind of a chilly but dry Tuesday night. By 11 o'clock, it's already down to you know, 40, 41 degrees. So this evening, we're dry, clouding up. Uh, 11 o'clock, we're down to about uh, 47. And then we jump ahead to... Uh, Tuesday morning, starting off with showers early, about uh, 40, 45. I'm thinking around 8, 9 o'clock in the morning, the showers coming to an end. Drier by noontime, uh, but the clouds do linger, though I do anticipate, again, uh, certainly not a complete clearing, but some breaks or some partial sun throwing, sh sun <laughs> sunshine. <laughs> I drank too much coffee. Sunshine through the cloud cover. You know, if the sun comes out a little earlier, we could add, you know, a few more degrees to that, but we're thinking mid and upper 50s. Should be 65. Uh, so it is cool, but at least it's dry uh, the second half of the day with a light uh, northerly breeze. All right, seven-day forecast. Now, we're, we're talking about unsettled. We really don't see any long stretches of uh, warm sunshine. So, you know, with the daylight hours of Wednesday, extra clouds, but it actually looks dry. Clouds, a little sunshine. Uh, temperatures about 55 to 60. We'll bring back precipitation later uh, Wednesday night, but the daylight hours of Wednesday, it looks dry. So a chance for showers, especially Thursday morning, cool at 55. Kind of cool, gray, and damp on Friday with an, an approaching warm front. 
probably not much higher than the mid-50s. Any early morning showers on Saturday ending, becoming partly sunny, a lot milder, certainly milder than Friday, 67. And right now, now granted, this is um, not six days out, uh, Sunday, uh, partly sunny, seasonable temps. There's the chance of a shower. Check back with us on that. I mean, that'd be nice to get that on Sunday night rather than Sunday day. So we'll kind of tweak the timing. And the overnight temperatures will be in the upper 40s to low 50s over the weekend. So in the short term, the best chance for wet weather is later tonight, early Tuesday morning, dry Tuesday afternoon. Wednesday day is dry. Another chance for showers Wednesday night, at least Thursday morning. Probably an all-day kind of showers or drizzle on Friday and then drying out uh, for Saturday. So it's a very uh, changeable week. Check back with us uh, throughout the week as far as any tweaks on the timing of the arrival of precipitation. I'll have another update tonight at 10 o'clock and again at 11 o'clock on Eyewitness News. And don't forget uh, meteorologist Michelle Muscatello in uh, early in the morning starting at 4.30 a.m. Thanks for logging in and we'll talk to you soon.